chains are out of the reach of Western sanctions. That's according to Russian lawmakers who have passed a new bill which is set to allow cryptocurrency in international trade. Now, the legislation also addresses the regulation of the crypto mining industry for citizens and businesses in Russia. The Russian Central Bank says it'll be enacted before the end of the year. And according to the authors of the bill, its aim is to use Bitcoin and other digital forms of currency as instruments to avoid Western sanctions. But we spoke with the executive director of Impact Harvesting, Chris Hart, who says the new settlement channel is for now out of the reach of Uncle Sam. The, the cryptos are put on a different uh, platform, okay? In other words, it doesn't follow the, the traditional settlement uh, uh, patterns that you have that are controlled by the U.S. and the U.S. dollar. Uh, it, so, so let's say India trades with Russia. Uh, there's a company in Russia, a company in India, they trade. Um, the the, the uh, Russian company has to, uh, if they're importing, would have to convert uh, the rubles that they're buying the goods with into dollars that would go to India and then they would convert it back to rupee. In that, that particular exchange, um, the U.S. Uh, has sight uh, and, and in a sense control and they are, are able to track um, that trade. The moment you actually put it through through an alternative channel, which the U.S. does not have control of, right? This is a private sector initiative, and um, and and uh, under a very different um, transmission mechanism, right? They cannot control or trace or track that uh, nearly as easily, and you can actually then have much freer trade in the world using that. One of the implications is by, by Russia legally embracing this, and I'll, I'll use that term embracing it, it may well end up that Russia may become a financial center like Hong Kong uh, or, and, and Singapore or even New York and London, but in the crypto space, because that is where it is actually nurtured, embraced. Finally, Russian businesses are facing foreign payment difficulties from Western sanctions. Russia legalized cryptos for payments to work around sanctions. On Tuesday, Russia passed the crypto bill. This is in addition to other bills that will regulate cryptocurrency mining. Under the legislation, cryptos will be regulated in the same way as foreign currency in Russia. The laws are scheduled to come into effect on September 1st. This action signifies a quick change in Moscow's attitude towards digital assets. Russian firms are facing payment difficulties due to U.S. threats of secondary penalties on international banks. Currently, digital currency used for payments are banned in Russia. Despite that, President Putin urged authorities not to miss the moment in regulating crypto payments earlier this month. Putin had said that cryptocurrencies are increasingly being used in the world as a means of payment in international settlements. Crypto's acceptance globally is on the rise, of course. The U.S. regulator's approval of a spot Bitcoin exchange traded funds opened the door for wider acceptance. Big investment like BlackRock betting big on Bitcoin funds has helped the crypto industry. Former U.S. President Donald Trump U-turned and became pro-crypto. He's also boosting the digital assets.